What's up Capoeira Life Addicts, this is Macaquinha with a sequence practice video I wanted to share with you as I mentioned on my Chapeo Gikoro tutorial I'm working on integrating this move in different ways inside the Hoda So here are a few sequences that I've been working on to kind of explore different ways of getting in and out of it And here's a preview of the full sequence which starts with a Mia Luigi French, Armada, Esquiva Lateral You switch, you cock the leg to get ready for the Chapeo Gikoro and then you come back with a counter Mia Luigi Compasso and now that you've seen the full sequence, let's go ahead and break it down little by little as I like to do my training. And the sequence starts with a Melody French, Armada, and then a Esquiva Lateral, which goes in the same direction as the kicks that you've just thrown. And once you get used to the details of those moves, then we can add the switch. Now there's a couple of things I want you to focus on as you're doing this move. Number one, notice that as I'm coming around, I'm actually looking through my legs at my opponent. So I'm keeping my eye on them as much as possible. Secondly, uh, when I come back from the move, I try to keep my elbow up to protect my face in case somebody decides to attack me as I'm doing that turn. And I want to take a little bit of time to focus on a tricky section for me, which was how to integrate the Chapeo Gikoro. So I'm going to skip the kicks and I'm going to focus on starting with the Esquiva Lateral. Then I'll do a switch. And as I turn around, I'm going to hook my foot. I'm coming in, defending my face again, as I mentioned before. And then I get out of it doing a Negachiva. And once you have that motion down, then you can start thinking about adding the Chapeo Gikoro. Or some people will call it the Martello du Chão. So again, it's a switch, then you cock the leg, and then you can throw that kick. If you have questions about this kick, you can go to my tutorial. I'll post links on the video as well as on the notes section below for you to take a look at different drills and different ways to go into a whole lot more detail on how to do that kick. Now with that, let's get back to the full sequence. So what we're going to do is we're going to add the Chapeo Gikoro section to the full sequence. Now I recommend as you're doing this training that you really focus on the details. Make sure that as you're turning around after the switch you're looking through your legs. You come back with your defense as well as that when you throw that Chapeo Gikoro your hips are high up to the sky. And you come back with your arm up to prevent any surprise kicks or attacks coming your way when you turn your back to your opponent. And the last move to add is going to be a Melo Gikomparso coming in the opposite direction of your Martello Duchamp. What I like about that is that it'll give you time to do a Esquiva Hecuada if an attack comes your way and then attack in a counter position to your previous kick. And there you have it Capoeira boys and girls, that's your full sequence. Now I couldn't help myself and I added a little bit of an extra section just for bonus. Now I'm not going to go into full details of this one, this is just meant for those who are more advanced. I want to add it at the end, I might actually turn it into a full video later on to go more into the details of it. And I just wanted to give you a quick disclaimer to let you know that these are sequences that I use to kind of help myself complementing the training that I already have. I'm not a high court, I'm not an instructor. So so these are just really meant to kind of complement the great training that you're already receiving from your masters. Realize that capoeira really comes in the hodas and the true, true culture of it comes from your masters. So keep that in mind as you're watching this. And I just want to say thank you guys for the great support, for watching, for subscribing, and for your comments. I would love to hear what you think about this video. If it's too fast, too slow, too advanced, what type of sequences you'd like to see more of. Just kind of curious to know what's out there. And this is Macaquinho signing out. Ah, shit.